Morning, everybody. I'm brushing my teeth. Mm mm mm. Get ready for the day. Who's rep? What are you watching? <laughs> Some of the, the beautiful day series. And you get to watch this one. Mm hmm. You should watch all of them. But, I mean, I'm gonna finish brushing my teeth here real quick. Alright. Today's the last day before I head out to Columbia tomorrow. Pretty excited, I get kind of nervous. I think it's just the travel excitement where you think the plane might crash or something, even though highly unlikely to happen. As the nerves kick in, you got your buddies. They're all excited. Rhett's excited that I'm leaving. It's gonna be so much fun. But tonight we got to, uh, I'm gonna pick up Rhett from Susie again tonight. And then my mom bought me and Tanner a bunch of little uh, like travel shampoos and deodorants and stuff. So we're gonna go over there for a little bit and hang out. And Rhett's gonna help me pack my bag. I'm just gonna relax and enjoy the night. So follow along, let's go. Yeah, just sitting here on my lunch break at work. Had to run and get some Taco Bell. Wasn't gonna take a lunch today and just get off uh, 5.30, but I think I'm gonna get my time in today. I'm supposed to get 40 hours, but you know, I'm just not feeling it. I just wanna get off now. I'm too, way too damn antsy for this trip. 5.30 just seems pretty late to me. I might take off like 4.30 maybe. Yeah. You guys tried them naked chicken chalupas at Taco Bell? I could eat about seven of them damn things. Just picked out. I'm gonna get back in though, but tomorrow's the big day. I think we're gonna head out about, mm, head to Omaha about 10.30. Try to get there at least an hour early. It's close to a two hour drive, so. Flight's at 1.45 and I'm taking Rhett to school in the morning and might hit the gym. I don't know, hit the gym tan. I wanna get some protein bars today too. Protein bars are coming pretty handy when you're just on long flights and waiting around the airport and Whenever you want to snack on something and save money, instead of spending $10 on a meal and airport food for something small. But yeah, tonight I'm going to pack up, so uh, Rhett's going to help me with that. And I'll show you what I packed, the essentials for Royaling Live. And alright, we'll see when I get off. Showed up at the grandparents' house. Just got off work. Rhett's over here with my Aunt Susie. What are you doing? Uh, what you got there? They hide all the fans. Oh, hello. Thank you, Mitch. That is going to get turned into chicken. There you are. There he is. Oh, there you are. That was cool. Get on us. I did. Are you guys watching? We're watching. Odd Squad. Odd Squad. Odd Squad. These kid friends are creatures. Watch this kid. Get warmed up now, watch it. <laughs> Hit that jump. Think of this midnight club night. Now, watch him. Now, watch him. I wish I had that car. Better than I miss. <laughs> you would, wouldn't you? Talk about a fail. I'll do it again, kids. <coughs> Talk about a fail. Making some, uh, some curry like usual. Mmm. Get up in there all nice and good. What? Ooh, yummy. Huh? No, it's a break. And our one is just to make you warm up. That's right. It's kind of dark in here. Let me brighten this thing up. Let the kids watch, he says. And go! Keep going. do it. Better not miss it again. <laughs> yeah, that's sick. I'm just about to do it. And you barely made it. Barely made it. <laughs> Me and Red are going to finish up eating. And we're going to head to my mom's. She has some stuff for us. For me and Tanner, anyway. And I'm going to come home and pack, do Red's homework, and then, uh, off to Columbia tomorrow morning. Yeah, tomorrow afternoon, morning. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, Rhett, almost dinner time, bud. Give him this damn game.
Tell the kids to watch this. They already seen it ten times. Let's eat dinner. Avery, Tanner's daughter, is scared to death of me. Avery! <laughs> yeah, she hates me. I scared her one day last summer. Never been the same since. My mom's traumatized too. Thinks we're gonna die on this trip. In case you go out and about and want to carry your camera gear in it, something or to drink. Water, yeah, if shorts, it needs to get dirty. <laughs> yeah, she hates me. Talk to me. <laughs> Did you see him? Taker! Taker! <laughs> Did you see him coming? He was watching your shadow. Taker! I like it, Taker! Alright, time to go, Rep. Poor Avery. Taker! Hey! Rep, it's time to get out of here. You just will not live. You're stabbing the cold. Yeah! Scoon on the <laughs> Rick, quit screwing around. Let's go. Heidi, mm. you can take that if you want. Real clean. <laughs> he's about bald. I tell him he needs when he goes there. He's gonna get sunburned so bad. He needs to rub that little bit yeah, all make sure over. You, uh... yeah, he's gonna be miserable. Yeah. <laughs> well, just finishing up the night, getting packed up, getting everything ready to go. I'm trying to pack as light as possible this time because usually I overpack, and I use a lot of stuff that I didn't even need to bring. As far as just like extra clothes and shirts and I don't know when you're when you're lugging your stuff around for like three or four different cities it's best to pack like minimal. So this time I'm just bringing five shirts, a pair of jeans because I think we're going to uh, in Bogota I think like the high is like 50 to 60. It's gonna be chilly at night and then a lot of pair of socks and it's like my old boxers and just stuff to toss as you go. You know there's no point in like hanging on to old stuff. Usually the only time I ever buy anything new is after a trip like this and then uh, just like all the basics little uh, what do you call it basic toiletries whatever you want to call it shampoo and deodorant and all that good stuff and then all my camera gear so take a look at this this is what I got here got this nice little bag came with my camera I got when I got from my dad little camera bag little pouch to put in my uh, all my battery packs and Little GoPro, that's Smith's actually. I'm bringing my GoPro, Hero 3. Got my Rode mic in here. Might not even use it because it seems like the audio on this is pretty good, but this goes with this, kind of like a buoy for the water so you don't drop it and lose it. Selfie stick, I got my, got my passport in there. Got all my other SD cards. Which I'm actually kind of mad because I ordered a 64 gig SD card to come before we left and it never showed up and my glasses never showed up so what do you expect and then I plan on just getting rid of all these throwing them around passing them out leaving them at bars everywhere we go eat and yeah and then my camera I'm on right now my Canon T6i 
but Brady actually just sent me a little link, or not a link, like a screenshot of a link, saying uh, it's bad to be carrying flashy camera or cameras around in Bogota. I don't know if that's true. Anybody that's from Bogota or anywhere in Colombia that's watching this right now, comment. Let me know what you think. Should I carry my camera around? Is it kind of... Am I going to get robbed or anything like that? I'm not really too worried about it, but you never know. When it comes to tourists and getting mugged, you don't want to have like nice equipment and stuff hanging out. But there's going to be six of us, so I'm really not worried about anything. And people are pretty nice all over the world, That, as far as I've seen. Everywhere I've been nervous to go, turns out everybody's just well-respected and awesome. But yeah, I'm just finishing up here. Cleaning up my house. I hate coming home to a messy house. And tomorrow's a big day. Gonna get up, make some good breakfast, get rid of all the old, uh, I got eggs and bread and milk and I'm just trying to clean up my fridge since I'm gonna be gone for a while. Have a good breakfast and take her out to school and try to hit the gym in the morning. Possibly get a haircut. We're heading out like 10.30, but yeah, I'll quit talking. End of the my battery just died on you guys, but as I was saying, end of the night here. I'm gonna get this video edited up so it's out tomorrow morning. And then, uh, yeah, follow along for the trip. Follow my Instagram, rail underscore God. Rail underscore God. I'm going to be putting a lot of pictures and little videos up on there. And then I'll uh, edit everything up when I get home. So, yeah, follow me. Subscribe. Please subscribe. These videos are going to be amazing. You'll love them, I promise. It's going to be such a great time. So, yeah, good night, everybody. We'll see you, uh, see you when I get back. Later.